he's really strong. He's so strong. <laughs> this is me. This is me when I play, and I'm like, I got my first. I'm really strong. I'm really strong. <laughs> that was awesome. Moves in now, finds Puppy's eyes there for the stun. The global afterwards, but Mickey Hardy charged it up. Now the chase, Nisha. Get back away. There's still Chrysalis to order the side, planking away. They have the damage, though. The front shield and the infest out of there again. So they lose Zai in exchange for Puppy, also oh. picking up box. Onto that, eventually is going to need to be dealing with this Wraith pack, which is just about did uh, by the Enigma as well. So we'll see if they can make those moves that they need to. Still another invasion coming in as they want to get aggro. They find resolution right on top with the trample, the walrus punch, and more round of onslaughts. More than enough, Anisha. Okay, turns into the Tusk and now ready to battle. They caught him caught here to the side and saying you're trying to stop oh, this right one. Back. Oh, the chain frost. It's bouncing, but not who needs to bounce to. Mickey does go down. Nisha in looking for more. And Science with the wraparound. Oh, they're all on top of him. The back of the middle. He gets the mirror up right on top. Able to catch him. But Tumba Man trying to arm with Tumba for all he's worth, but they're all falling. Secret keeps the pain train rolling as they all die. <laughs> have that damage yet. He only has the Dragon Lance at this point. It's going to need to come later on. Yeah, Liquid are playing like a team that had a, a lane lead. Radiance and they're, they're trying to pressure, trying to play that game right now, but they didn't necessarily gain one. Uh, and plus the fact that you you don't have this mid hero that plays off of like a blink, you have a who plays off a of BKB, and he just hit that right now, 16 minutes. Xenia, again gonna drop his secret. No, that, that's how unsure they are of like what's happening right now, right? Yeah, they're behind him. They're ready to go. Gotta watch this Carapace. It's level four right now. Could botch an initiation that comes in, especially if you're not careful with that first BKB play. Playing around this area, Nisha, they roll in, miss there on him, but find a couple more. Spike he Carapace up. up to the roll in, finds him. And Nyx is dead, buyback immediately, global to turn this. They only have the Tusk in hand though. Now turning on to Zai, the fear interrupting. Zai has Black Hole available if they want to drop it. Global already down, but there's so much damage coming from the high ground. He's just caught and killed. Body and then charging in right after him is just the creeps coming in from Rezo, right? And they're just like filling in this space. Crystals has a full on vanguard of units and heroes ahead of him, gives him the space for the damage. You can see the inability of Zai to really play this engagement and instantly for the prize of that victory, Secret heading towards Roche. Yeah, that is huge for them. So they're going to get this one out in Liquid. Because they have this this tusk, right? He kind of commits to an area, so you get four staffed out. Your fight breaks down. A life stealer. One of the names he hates seeing the most is his four staffs. He's just trying to stick on people, as the maybe the open wounds will help him with. So getting there for puppies actually gonna be pretty important for them. Zayat runs into a wary little Nyx assassin, and they're gonna bring down that Enigma eventually. Liquid gonna... themselves. A minute and a half left on this age, just roughly. Tries to finish off his Magnum Scepter, uses the Pulverize, Rezo finds him, walks around the corner. They do still have BKB TP, but not nearly enough. Too much damage. So much vision. They, they see what Liquid are up to, and I'm sure they, they're well aware that they are taking a lead. They don't even like, I was talking about the Magnum Scepter, but Nisha is just going in for the Scotty. He's opting to go for this beat them down, right click build. But Tink. Well, another sacrifice here given over to the gods. It's going to be insane. You brought down. Can the rest of them get out? Matumbo Man, he's rage. Snowball in to try and get him away as Mickey is yeah, getting committed. Humbled. Nisha chase, Nisha kill. A double for the more. Ready to go in for a bit more. Insane. He bought back from this one. He's got to get out of there. The chain drops. But look at him go. They're on top of Boxy. He is also going to go down. Matumbo Man looking for a bash. Hoping to go toe to toe. Gets more. But secret there. A little bit of vision. And then maybe birds a couple of stuns. But then you can go for that fight. Maybe that's their best moment. But secret were willing and ready. Secret. It's all over them here, and they will claim two sets of racks as soon as one of those boars or something comes on up to the high ground. But that blink dagger reveal from Zayats and Matama Man, he's in pretty far, wants to take him down, gets one kill. They're able to assassinate the assassin, but it is a pure victory if I ever saw one. At Team King Gold lead now after that high ground push. Uh, that's a big one. And that's how it started, you know? This comes in, a couple heroes are in vision. You think, okay, is this our chance? And they, they thought about backing, but then the roar occurs. Mickey's forced to commit. Didn't really get a whole lot of value out of the Agnums, I would say. And then, of course, uh, Nisha becomes better primal beast. Sai found again. Nisha immediately gets out of there. The haste room keeping him alive. Ready to chase after Foxy now with the Scotty done. They got to run. Catches on to this Beastmaster. Do they have any more buybacks? It's already three dead. This is looking so rough.
up for Liquid. Nick A, he's got a life stealer bomb inside of him, but Nisha ready to take him down. The triple kill. Nisha will not be denied. As